you have activated your red buttons. Now it means that you have you have allowed yourself to enter the world of the Nevermind Buzzcocks post-show red button debate with myself, TV's Bill Juniper, and little Joel Fieldmouse <laughs> over here. <laughs> Hello. How are you doing, my friend? I'm very. Ha I'm happy. Um, um, as, as ever, you know that the, at this point of the show, you and I reach down in our hat and have verbal fisticuffs. Pluck out, pluck out of the hat a topic to discuss. A filthy topic. Mm. This week, what has come out of the hat is which do we prefer, cold sores or cold play? It's a tough one. Could be a short debate. Yeah, yeah, this one might not run too long. Well, let's look at the two. <laughs> let's look at the two things. Cold sores. Cold sores. The tingle uh, on your lips. Mm, herpes. It is, as in essence. Some, as in essence. Otherwise known. I know. When you call it herpes, it sends those in your immediate circle into something of a tailspin. I know. People don't like it when you say, I think you might have herpes now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whereas a cold sore, it's something that you find quite reassuring coming from someone. Oh, yeah. you got a bit of a cold sore on the go there. Have you got anything for it? It leads to nice social debate, whereas as soon as the H-bomb is dropped, then all conversation ceases. I can't actually get cold sores. Why not? I don't know. My doctor said I can't get them. I'm immune to them. That's but, fabulous. But I can get the virus that is herpes and pass it on to other people. So you can actually <laughs> carry. Your mouth is a carrier. <laughs> I'm a giver, but wow. I can't receive. That's How not, cool is that? That's bad. I can always, I always, I tend to get, they, they're of course at the corner of the mouth hmm. uh, and uh, the, the tingling starts on day one, but I'm always, I'm a big pre-applicator. Really? I always uh, self-medicate. Really? When uh, cold sores strike. Really? Yeah. yeah. I see, I've never had the tingling. Honey. I've always, honey. honey. You use honey. Buzz gum. But, well, raw honey from a bee's yeah, hive. Yeah, crazy jelly. In its rawest form. Wing custard. You get a bee to apply it with its little legs. Yeah, queen wax. Call it what you will. <laughs> it does the job. <laughs> queen lube. It's nice. You get it on there. And then... They well, look... then your mouth is covered with wasps, and that's a, that's a whole other thing to deal with, but it does put you off the cold sore. Wow. So that's cold sores. I don't mind cold sores. I think they're quite no. sexy. How will you find them sexy? Well, you know, in a sort of punky... There's a girl, she's a punk, she looks like she smells of Farley's rusks or wee. We're not talking enough about Coldplay, Joel Fieldmouse. <laughs> Coldplay. You like them? No. 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 <laughs> no. No. I always imagine in those sort of melodic piano things, putting dynamite under one of the keys of the piano and him playing and then... And then me listening to Aerosmith or Suicide and being happy. <laughs> happy again. <laughs> They did a song called The Scientist. Mm. No scientific content at all. The science teacher. Not, not, not one. Nothing. <laughs> no periodic Just, charts. The scientist. Anything about Newton's third law? No. You would have thought Bunsen Burma would have at, at least, least got in the intro. Something. Chris Martin. Chris Martin. Mm. I saw um, three broad stripes, which is some sort of a symbolic thing to indicate he, that he's simpatico with Oxfam. But then underneath <laughs> that, underneath that, it said, uh, it said milk bread. <laughs> I like the fact, that's the best thing I've ever heard about him, that he draws on himself. Yeah, he, he does. He thinks he's a notebook. The first thing he does before he goes out, <laughs> gets his sharpie. He woke up and thought it was a stationary shop. This, there's enough of this. I mean, that's... that's cold sores or cold, cold sores play. or cold play. What are the points, Noel Fielding, for cold sores? Nine. Cold play. A fizzy nine, but for cold play, yeah. one. Ah, oh, nine one. I don't know what that takes the to totals to, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, on the never mind the Buzzcocks red button debate. But that's cold sores nine, cold play one. Please fill in your pools coupons now. I've angered a lot of people. <laughs>